I want to ask you guys first how we feel um, about the transition of power happening on The Bachelorette. <laughs> It's is it peaceful? <laughs> we have you know. um, you, we're now in we're now with Tasha and how excited have you guys been to see Tasha? We I mean it feels like finally we are switching regimes. Um, <laughs> and I mm -hmm. felt when they like started the the whatever that like after the final rose weird segment was, yeah. I was like, God, I I can't with it anymore. Um, so I'm just like ready to be in an actual season because I, I don't get me wrong. I've like lived for this mess of a season so far, but I'm like, I need to like, I, I need stability. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. yeah. It feels like we were going from preseason to, um, you know, the normal season, like, let's go where it's like, finally we're in the, um, in the stream of things where we can like, we know that she's actually looking to talk to all of these guys because it really was just Claire wanting to talk to one guy and we were, we all knew. And so we were sick of it and we were fatigued because we knew it was going to happen. So we're like, okay, can we get the real show on the road now? So we can actually figure out what's going on. Yeah. The thing I'm excited about with Tasha is I feel like we're going to see multiple love stories. Yes. We root for the, the, main person yeah. the bachelor bachelorette whoever it is to fall in love but we like to see them fall in love with like three or four yeah. people so it's kind of like yeah. a game it's a race who's gonna win it's a battle you know with claire it was kind of like all right we got it she loves dale but with Tasha, i already feel like we're gonna have multiple love stories here yeah yeah i feel refreshed and i think all the guys in the house feel refreshed as yeah. soon as she walked in and as soon as people got the opportunity to to pull her away and talk to her everyone wanted to do it i know we had talked a lot about ivan yeah. he we were he was the first guy to talk to Tasha, so and it was it was like oh we we these are guys that we're going to get to know i think it actually is a great crop of guys we just weren't able to see that with claire's you know she was obsessed with dale that was all she talked about ever so now being able to see the personality of these guys and i do think we have a good crop of guys this yeah. season for sure it was a good reminder um, right off the bat that like this is a really good group of guys and we haven't gotten to know them at all. We've gone, you know, yeah. four full weeks not really getting to see any of these guys talk. So right away, it's like, wait, these guys are all really great. Yeah, that's how I felt watching. I was like, who is that? Oh, who yeah. is that? Oh my <laughs> like God. I've literally never seen half of these guys before in my life until <laughs> tonight. Like Brendan, I was like, he's who is that? <laughs> And now he's like the main character. I, like, yeah. I'm, I'm well, that's when they brought the new guys in and he was like, you can tell they like feel like they need to pull her aside first to because they're on not the same playing field. But I'm like, oh, honey, no, you're on the exact same playing field. Like same. these men have just been sitting here the whole time. They yeah. haven't talked to a woman in weeks either. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah it was funny seeing like the pre Tasha people go up against the post Tasha people being like, we've been here for the longer and it's like, it doesn't matter anymore. Right, they're like the it jaded doesn't. vets. They're like, we've been waiting weeks to talk to Claire. It's like, we, just, just oh, talk Claire, to her. Tasha, and we haven't even talk got a chance. anyone. Yeah. yeah, and they've had yeah. the same amount of time with Tasha as the new guys. So it's not like, yeah. oh, you know, we've been trying to talk to Tasha. You didn't even know Tasha was coming until five minutes ago. Same things with these dudes. Yeah. 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 So we got four new guys. Thankfully, Tasha did get a little bit of a limo entrance. Obviously, she wasn't going to get that since all these guys were already there and we already saw them. But there were four guys that came out of the limo. Spencer, Montel, Peter, and Noah. We don't really know too much about these guys. It's been kind of crazy because we we did nothing but stare at the photos of the guys cast for Claire season <laughs> yeah. Like, yeah forever for for weeks just being like I, we got to find out what's going on with these guys looking at their social media looking at their bios everything so here's four new guys that we don't really um know a lot about obviously Spencer it seems like had the biggest impact out of all of them but what do we think about Noah he's 25 the mustache. He, the mustache. Yep. He's a registered travel nurse, mm -hmm. which is interesting. What does that mean? What exactly. That? Unsure. So, like it, he has an airplane also, and a stethoscope in his yeah. bio. <laughs> like I feel like he should probably be doing more important things than being on The Bachelorette right now. If that's the case, <laughs> that yeah. is a how many great registered point. travel nurses are there? And he's like, actually, sorry, I'm taking my <laughs> to Palm Springs, especially like, during COVID. Pandemic. He's like, I'm out. <laughs> That is actually a phenomenal point because his and his Instagram, I did 
take a look before he's definitely traveling he or has been traveling pre uh pandemic it looked like he's been all over the world um he the mustache is, it like is influencer tough. traveling or is it it's, like it's like it's to be honest it's both like it's the intent is not for it not to be an influencer travel post. It's like, hey, I'm a nurse helping people. Yeah. But the pictures themselves look like an influencer I travel. I mean, his his account should be the registered travel nurse. And yeah. like then he's like blowing up. Like yeah. that is prime yeah. content. So <laughs> his question? his Instagram is baby herb. His name is Noah Herb. Oh. Um, his bio what is tra- his bio is travel nurse that loves Jesus, loves people, loves living, and refuses to leave this world unchanged with the hospital emoji and the prayers yeah. emoji. Yeah, that's all pretty standard there. <laughs> you got it I all mean, in there, Jesus, yeah. people. <laughs> yeah, red flags yeah. all around. <laughs> um, yeah. Yeah. My question is, where were these men? Like, where have they been? Because also right. when he, when Spencer got out of the, the limo, he was like, oh, I, I, I know it's a big surprise to, like, see you here. And I'm like, how do you know that? Where did you come from? Yeah. You, have they, also, right. Like, they're, how they're long doing, have they just been in hiding, these four guys? <laughs> weeks, right? They yeah. must have been yeah. there for, like, in case Claire needed extra guys or something. They've been sitting in that limo since, like, the yeah. premiere yeah. episode. <laughs> doing laps Run around away. La Queen stuff. <laughs> It is interesting because we never get the real timelines of these events because I would like to no. know how long Claire was there in real time. How long did they know they were going to have to bring in Tasha? And then like you're saying, when do they bring in these other guys or do they keep them on the property? Yeah. It's just all very interesting that we don't have it. We don't get we get no answers to it. Well, Tasha did say, you know, a week ago, I would have never imagined myself here. So I was like, wait a second. <laughs> you didn't know yeah. a week ago that you were going to be the bachelorette. Like, how did this happen? Right, how did right. we do this? You definitely Are we knew cut a week some ago. corners. <laughs> yeah, because like, you're really supposed like, to be quarantined for two Tasha! weeks. Tasha, <laughs> <laughs> everyone's everyone's gonna start pointing their fingers now. You know, yeah. I I feel yeah. like a snitch. I almost wish I didn't say that part <laughs> because now I feel like I'm snitching on them. But she did say that. Yeah, no, she definitely did. Noah, um, I believe Noah was on like the mega list of guys that came out before Claire's season. It was like 40 plus Spencer guys. I think was too. I think okay. Spencer was too. So these guys were involved and then somehow ma- didn't make the cut. I would assume Noah didn't make the cut because of his age. Um, did he you always know? have the stash oh, in the sense. pictures? Yes. Porno stash? The stash was in the cast photo. I went back and looked. You also have <laughs> to think about the fact that like, um, getting all of the contracts signed and yeah. getting them approved to leave work. Like that's not all happening in two weeks. So they definitely have taken these guys from like before to bring them back and be like, Hey, we're actually going to use you. Yeah. And we yeah. already have your contract signed and ready to go. These anyway, guys have been so. on the bench. They've been, they've yeah. been waiting yeah. to put me, put me in coach. That's what they're saying. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. The background checks alone, they have to like do, I'm assuming, or they should they be. Should. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> in t- Cause remember, uh, they're, who was the guy where it like came out that he had been like arrested for sexual assault on a cruise ship or something? Yeah, oh, I think that was half a season, right? The yes. Last... And it, yes. After that, they were like, was, but yes. they were like, we need to do like more significant background <laughs> yeah. checks. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So then it's like, okay, we found these guys at the La Quinta. Just get in the limo. <laughs> but... <laughs> Kidnaps all these like random yeah. dudes. <laughs> I was hoping they were They've maybe... actually been in the trunk and they just dusted them off. To yeah. them <laughs> They're like all disoriented. Like, where am I? I was hoping they would maybe bring back some of the uh, old, uh, some of Claire's. It was really just Tyler C. New Tyler C. Yeah. New Tyler C would have been good. Obviously, we didn't want Yosef back in the picture, no. but it would have been what a triumphant return it would have been for some of those guys who thought they were going home and then they get to come Paige, back. Paige, the, the, who's Paige? The chef. Remember him with the tattoos? No. You don't oh remember him. I don't think I, I don't remember that don't person either. Remember anyone remember that ringing any bells? Like, but again, there were so many people that I was like, "Who the hell is that?" Yeah, yeah. So like, I didn't know who Ivan was. There's until still tonight. so many men on this show. Like we're Who's so. Ed? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, I'll tell you. Trent I knows will tell Ed. you all about Ed. I love Ed. He is maybe I, my. He's just sort of there, but he doesn't go get to go on group dates. He doesn't get to go on one on ones. No. He just the camera whenever they're all hanging out by the pool, Ed's always sitting there. I, I'm a big fan of Ed. I hope he makes it all the way. I hope when there's five guys left, somehow Ed is just standing there. She's I like, really oh, hope shit, so. Shit, I forgot that Ed was there. Yeah. <laughs> 
Listen, that's my type. Fade into the fade into the walls. That's yeah. what I want. Background. You're not alone because I put up a picture of Ed early on, just being like, I want to give a shout out to Ed, and people had the same reaction, like, who is this person? And that's kind of why I like Ed because he's kind of in the shadows. But I, I think he's gonna stick around for a while. At least I hope. I don't know. It's so many of these guys. Like, like we said, we definitely. It forgot that they were present on this season at this point. Mm -hmm. um, so they're back. Tasha is giving them some time. They all want to talk to Tasha. It's very obvious. Um, they she canceled the first row ceremony. row ceremony because she just wanted to get to know the guys. I like the move. I feel like that's a classic. Like let me win some brownie points with the guys. Maybe they're iffy on me. Like she might have been nervous with the Claire stuff, even though she had no reason to be nervous. Like those guys, yeah. their jaws hit the floor when they saw Tasha <laughs> walk in. Well, do you guys think that production, well, obviously, got in her ear and they were like, we're going to make you seem like the best bachelorette ever because people really start to turn on Claire. So now with this whole cocktail party right. thing or rose ceremony, ceremony, they're like, no, we're canceling this Tasha. Tell the guys that you really want to get to know them. Like, they're like trying to make her act the exact opposite of what oh, Claire yeah. was and like. Oh, yeah. And meanwhile, Chris Harrison's like ready to jump, jump the second she's like, we're going to cancel the rose ceremony. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Cocktail parties, like what? Yeah, yeah. again, and like. I also feel like production's probably like you know when like you get um, a new boss and you're like, oh, it's just that you're so much better than my old boss. I don't know anything about you, but I just didn't like my old boss. That's probably the vibe from production where they're like, we could not stand Claire. Yeah. She was so because like amid all the she's like, I decided we canceled the day date and like the production assistants that have spent hours like. Collecting the pool floats for yeah. that. Like, well, so yeah, it is. I feel like <laughs> it is kind of like a, when, a, yeah. when a new boss throws a pizza party and everybody's yeah. like, oh, this is great. This person's way better. Right. Yeah. Right. I wonder if the, I do wonder if they filled in Claire. Maybe they didn't say we're going to cancel the rose ceremony. We want all these things to happen so the guys like you. But maybe they were like, Claire, this is all the things she did. Maybe try to do the opposite of everything because she basically did exactly that. Yeah. 